V is uh, priced at it's the prices start from rupees seven point seven five lakh for the S uh, variant, and uh, this is for the petrol. The car is offered in four uh, variants only, uh, so it's the S and VX for petrol and diesel. So the petrol variant starts at seven point seven five lakh for the SMT, and the VX is priced at eight point nine nine lakhs uh, ex showroom Delhi. Now the diesel S is priced at 8.79 lakhs, while uh, the VX goes for 9.99. So that's. About 100 bucks short of uh, 10 lakhs. Now about the car, uh, it's powered by two engines. The petrol is a 1.2 liter uh, four-cylinder iVTEC. Whereas the diesel is the 1.5i DTEC engine, again a four-cylinder. So the power figures are the same as the Jazz. Uh, the petrol makes uh, 90 PS of power and 110 newton meters of torque, whereas the diesel makes 100 PS of power and 200 newton meters of torque. Now, any of you who've uh, read the review or seen the video uh, would know that the petrol does feel a little underpowered, whereas the diesel is the engine you would want to have. Uh, It's not exactly an SUV, Kastuba. Uh, it's more of a cross hatch. So it's a crossover. It's based on the Jazz. Uh, it's much bigger than the Jazz. Uh, just here, the diesel prices uh, start from 8.79 and go up to uh, for the S variant and 9.99 for the uh, top of the line VX variant. Uh, Lalit, four variants only. यश अगर पसंद नहीं है तो देन यार इट्स नॉट रियली आ कॉल इज इट सो डिजाइन वाइज लुक्स रियली नाइस स्पेशली द रियर प्रशांत विल जस्ट गेट टू द इंटीरियर इन अ बिट सो एज यू कैन सी द हेड द टेल लैम्प्स अ न्यू दे लुक क्वाइट गुड एंड गिव द कार अ बिट ऑफ वॉल्यूम साइज वाइज ऑल्सो इट्स एक्चुअली क्वाइट लार्ज व्हील बेस इज टू ट्रिपल फाइव एम एम विच इज अबाउट 50 mm more than the Jazz. Lalit, it is similar to the Eco Sport. Uh, it falls in the same segment, as in the uh, same price point. Uh, Sri, we will just get to the interior uh, in a bit. So the wheels are new. They are 16 inches compared to 15 inch uh, on the Jazz. Uh, Shankar, the petrol variant comes with a five-speed manual. The diesel comes with a six-speed manual. The diesel also gets a cruise control, uh, and but uh, there is no CVT option. Alin, yes, this is the top end. This is the VX. Now I'll just get to the interior of the car. So this being the VX variant, this is the top of the line. Well, we are outside, so there's no key in the car, so. Won't be able to show you the how the display or anything works. Uh, so, Mitra, the ground clearance is 188 mm. Uh, just Kirat, it's not platinum. Uh, it's titanium. So, this is the interior. Uh, it comes. I mean, it's the first car under 10 lakhs to feature a one-touch electric sunroof. So this being the diesel, you get a six-speed uh, manual gearbox. Uh, Manish, you can't get four people in the car. I mean, in the back seat of any car. Yeah, uh, it can seat two. Three is a bit of a squeeze. Uh, speaking of the back seat, uh, Honda has also done away with the the famed magic seats. So now it's a sixty-forty split, and. Uh, Uh, so now it's a uh, total. Uh, so the whole thing comes down. Uh, you have lots of cubby holes here to store your bottles. This one is the cool compartment where you can store your glasses, uh, your cans uh, whenever you're driving. Uh, honey, the music system is this. It's the new DigiPad infotainment system, seven inches, Android based. Unfortunately, I can't show it to you guys right now because the there is no key in the car. Uh, Aniket, I'm really sorry. I can't start the car. Because uh, oh, it's on. So this is the wait. Let's wait for it to come on. Give it a few seconds. 
So Shank, uh, the diesel starts from 8.9. Uh, yeah, so that there it is. It's the new infotainment system. Sorry about that. Uh, so yeah, that's the uh, that's the new infotainment system. So you get lots of uh, customization options. You can choose what you want on your home screen. You have navigation system by Map My India. Uh, Akash, yes, it does get a uh, sunroof, and it is one of the few car. I mean, it's the only car net and lacks to be so. Uh, plus, you get Bluetooth connectivity. You also get uh, internet. Uh, for your maps and emails and uh, browser but that has to be sourced by your phone and uh, there is a little so there is a little uh, dongle you have to buy from Honda so for that to work with your phone plus you even get an HDMI port which is new for something like this and also a 12 volt socket uh, for charging on the go a USB then you get this uh, armrest here which can open up and you can store your iPads and iPhones here. Uh, you can even connect them to the infotainment system. You get an additional uh, USB port here and a 12 volt socket. The seats themselves are quite comfortable and uh, this being the top of the line, uh, this being the top of the line you even get uh, steering which is adjustable for reach and height. So that's uh, quite good. Uh. Adinath boot space is 363 liters, uh, which is uh, like 9 liters more than the Jazz. The Manish touch is slightly slow. I mean, it's a little slow to respond. So if I press, so it takes about uh, half a second to actually, you know, uh, take the input. But apart from that, uh, according to Honda, I mean, it, it works really well. Sunny, yes, this is the top model. So you get uh, touch start, keyless entry. Yeah, Prithviraj, sure. Jawahar, given the, De the Delhi traffic conditions, I wish, man, I really wish it could fly. But unfortunately, it doesn't. So there are the front seats. Uh, these are the rear seats. So as you can see, there is ample room. So I am about six feet tall and I was comfortable in the front and you can see there is ample knee room. Uh, yes, the prices start from 7.75 for the petrol S manual and uh, go all the way up to 9.99 for the diesel VX. Now as for the uh, fuel efficiency is uh, CAF no AMT, no CVT, only manual gearboxes. Uh, as for the fuel efficiency, the petrol it go, it like makes 17.5 uh, kmpl, which is actually slightly lower than the Jazz. Uh, same thing with the diesel as well, 25.5 kmpl from the 1.5 uh, ID Tech. Uh, the wheels are larger though, uh, 16 inches. Uh, you get 188 uh, mm of ground clearance, which is ample for uh, our roads. Uh, Prashant, there are no rear AC vents, uh, I'm sorry, if you want to take a look, uh, there it is. Uh, yes, the petrol is 1.2 litres, which is 1200cc and the diesel is 1.5, which is 1498cc, roundabouts. Uh, Prashant, no AMT, no CVT, only manual gearboxes. Uh, Surinder tyre size is 195, 60 sidewall with the 16, 16 inch wheels. Uh, so these are wider tires compared to the Jazz, so it gives a wider track, uh, which means more high speed stability. Plus uh, the diesel is slightly heavier than the petrol, so the suspension is slightly stiffer sprung, so which should give you a better ride on the highway as well. Uh, the petrol is lighter and uh, feels slightly underpowered. Uh, I'll show you guys the boot. There it is, so it's a pretty big boot. Uh, there's a wall behind me, so I can't really go any further. Uh, CAF, yes, it does get LED DRLs, and uh, though the uh, headlamps are halogens. Nyan, ground clearance 188, uh, Arjun 188, Ashish Bhalla, 
सत्रह दशमलव पाँच और पच्चीस दशमलव पाँच दे दिया सर सेवनटीन पॉइंट फाइव फॉर द पेट्रोल ट्वेंटी फाइव पॉइंट फाइव फॉर द डीजल अब्दुल ऑन रोड डीजल प्राइस वुड कम अप टू सम टॉप ऑफ द लाइन वुड गो फॉर समवेयर अराउंड इलेवन वेर एज द एस गो फॉर समवेयर अराउंड टेन आ गोश टोटल ऑफ सिक्स कलर्स अवेलेबल वन न्यू दिस इज द न्यू कलर दैट यू सी इन फ्रंट ऑफ यू सो दिस इज द ऑल न्यू कलर दैट्स अवेलेबल and uh and yes key boot opener is there rajput yes it's available in diesel saurab prices from 7.75 to 9.99 sahi uh, we'll only be able to tell you that after we've done the road test yeah can't comment at this point uh rahul the petrol makes 90 ps the diesel makes uh 100 sashank it's 1500 cc not 1.5. Pradeepan <coughs> uh, seating capacity four in comfort uh, five if you are okay with a little, little slightly constrained space. Shabir 188 uh, mm of ground clearance. And uh, yes, yeah, a lot of people have been asking about the sunroof, so it's. a first in segment so that's the sunroof it's a one touch electric uh caf we have driven the car so the ride quality is nice the diesel is slightly better than the petrol uh and i mean it's pretty well equipped to uh handle the indian roads in terms of safety you get abs ebd and front dual airbags as standard across all variants uh uh sagar the airbags are as standard on the dual front airbags just are as standard on all variants the s and the vx for both petrol and diesel uh headlights are not <coughs> excuse me the headlights are uh, not projectors they are normal halogens uh mudassir the uh, power again 90 ps on the petrol and 100 ps on the diesel Mihir, the music system is the new DigiPad infotainment system, uh, which is the actually the party piece of the WRV, and it. Is straight from the city. Uh, Vikram, the prices start from seven point seven five, uh, and go for the petrol base S. and the go all the way up to uh, 9.99 for the diesel i'll just show you the uh, engine tanmay thank you i've always considered that as well uh, so with no automatic only manuals the petrol comes with a 5 speed manual and the diesel comes with a 6 speed manual also the diesel also comes with a cruise control which the petrol doesn't get so now that is the 1.5 id tech a uh, dreams engine again uh, for ones who missed 100 ps of power 200 newton meters of torque and 25.5 kmpl so you can't even buy tanmay you can't even buy a toffee in zero rupees yeah anyway uh, so that's all from us guys uh, we have come to you from the wrv launch uh, that's the car 